That looks like a good shot. Has it got distance on it? No, gone. Imad bowls his first over and gets a wicket straight away. Iftikhar takes the catch and Adam Milne has to walk. Even that is light in the pace. Thus, a little bit of turn to straighten that. But didn't get to the pitch of the ball. Adam Milne has got it high. Asking for a catch and he's been awarded two and two for Imad Basim. Matt Henry goes first ball. Does he go upstairs? Keep rolling frame by frame. Uh, please it here. Yeah, inside edge from uh, Matt Henry's bat. Imad Basim on a hat trick. Can we have two in one T20 international? First Matt Henry, now Imad. Has nice, played well with the, the middle of the bat. Yeah! Exactly like that, but it doesn't come off. It's slower, it's into the stumps, the sweep across the line, and he's been castle. It's more of a heave across the line. A very accurate Imad Vaseem enticing the batter and the batter while he's gone for it. Chad Bowles, he gets castled. The skipper, well, he can rejoice even more. Imad into the wickets, he's got his first. It's Bowles, he goes for 26. New Zealand 52 for two. Gotcha. Latham goes for the sweep. He's top edged fielder under, takes it. Harris Rowe, brilliant on the outfield. Pakistan draw first blood. It was a little bit quicker from Imad Wazim. Latham almost heading across the swing path of Imad, but getting a top edge, rolling his hands on it. And well, any catch is a good catch. <laughs> And it's the captain, Tom Latham. He goes for 13, 24 for one. Pulled him, chopped it on. The follow-up delivery, well, Imad Vaseem has the last laugh as he picks up two. Well, he's a tough bowler to hit through the leg side because the ball skids, skids low. Let's try and play that stroke. I think Will Young would have been better off trying to cut it just like he did the previous delivery. Fortunately, he has to go for six, 44 for two. And there you go, again, that bounce. It just didn't get up, did it? Mitchell was trying to get to the ball, came down the wicket and just went under his bat. And Rizwan does the rest, so that's three to the spinner here. Getting through the ball, Mitchell wanted to get the intent trying to get out to the pitch. It was just the wrong option to that delivery and Rizwan, as quick as you like, whips the bails off. Daryl Mitchell, this is a big loss for New Zealand. He departs for just the three today. 54 for three. Oh, he's chopped it on. Chad Bowles has been cleaned up. Third one walks to the dugout. Well, another innings from Chad Bowles. He was looking great. Everything in the middle of the bat, that one giving himself some room, trying to hit him through the offside. You don't mind the strategy, but Imad Wazim has got the ability to skid the ball on. It means Chad Bose is going for 19. It's 26 for three. Catch it! It's in the air. Shouts off. Catch, and it is taken. Harris Rove with the catch. Imad Wazim gets his second wicket. Excellent boundary rider, very well judged catch over his head and Imad once again showing why he is so good in this format. He picks up his second wicket and most importantly it's of the danger man, Daryl Mitchell. Once again tonight, just the 15 off the 18, New Zealand lose their fourth for 73.